Hey guys, I'm Matt Asplund and welcome back to another Unreal Engine Fab Marketplace video. This is the limited time free for the second part of August 2025 where we've got access to three amazing assets for free once again until the 26th of August. So you can keep them forever but you have until the 26th of August to claim them. So this time around we've got the Warehouse Environment, the Werewolf Mythical Creature and the Magic Spline plugin. So without further ado, let's get right into it, starting with the warehouse environment. So this asset pack is an extensive and highly detailed warehouse environment which can be used for both games and cinematics. It features highly detailed and highly modular assets that allow you to create warehouses and storage facilities in as many shapes and sizes as you want. There are more than 165 high quality modular assets, not counting white box demo assets. It is nanite and lumen compatible with modular flexibility in assets where logical. There are also advanced master materials with material controls for roughness variation, dust control and much much more and there's also a full gameplay ready demo scene to showcase how you can use the assets as well. So one thing I love about this being modular is it means you can take this pack and create absolutely anything you want with it so everybody can have the same warehouse pack but everybody's warehouses can look completely and entirely different which is absolutely amazing. So in total there are 174 assets, 164 not including the demo assets. There is automatically generated collision, 7 materials and 97 material instances and 199 textures with the text resolutions being 4k, 2k, 1k and 512. So I think this one looks absolutely amazing. The personal license for this is normally £81 and the professional is normally £500, so that's a big steal and a big bargain if you get that as well. And next up, we have the Werewolf Mythical Creature Bonus Zombie Neon Skin. So this is a character which is rigged and rigged to the epic skeleton with IK bones included, and there are six animations included within this as well, all of which are in place. And those animations are Attack, Walking, Idle, Death and Get Hit, and that's five. The sixth one is this, there's two idle animations. The poly count of the skin with no fur is 5,903 vertices and 11,416 tries. And the poly count of the skin with full fur is 15,889 vertices and 16,456 tries. So there's one character included, but obviously two skins as I just went over there. There's 14 materials and material instances with 36 textures and all of those textures are at 4k resolution. So again, I think this one looks absolutely great. The personal license for this is normally £17 and the professional is normally £53. And finally, last but not least, we've got the Magic Spline plugin. So this is a plugin which allows the creation of the spline mesh actor in your levels to generate and edit meshes following a spline mesh and these can be static meshes or spline meshes with deformation. This is a powerful level design tool that can be used in many different ways for example, creating walls, roads, pipes, chains, fences, and blocking volumes in an optimized way. So it's optimized because this is written in C++, but you don't actually need to know any C++ programming to be able to use this. Because as you've seen in the video on screen now, this is used entirely through blueprints. All you have to do is just create a new blueprint based on the class SME Spline Mesh Actor, then you can add this blueprint actor to your levels and just edit the settings within the details panel as again you can see on screen now. However if you do know C++ and would like to add some extra functionality to this plugin it's also possible as the source code is provided too. So some of the main features of this are layers which is a group of segments and settings allowing multiple meshes to be attached to the same spline. You can enable collision on spline mesh as well. You can curve the meshes to create chains, screws and much more and you can use different settings for specific segments of the spline. It's also possible to bake all the actors into a static mesh as well. So if you want to create a long fence out of this spline, for example, and then make it one static mesh for optimization reasons, you can do that very easily too. That is obviously just a thing built into Unreal, not specific to this plugin, but it's worth mentioning. So again, this looks amazing. The personal license for this is 12 pounds normally, and the professional license is normally 28 pounds. And so with that, I think that'll be it for this video of covering the monthly free assets we've got for the second half of August 2025. Again, we've got the warehouse environment, the werewolf mythical creature, and the magic spline plugin. I think my favorite one this time around is probably the magic spline plugin, 
but let me know in the comments down below which one your favorite one was as well so thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and hope you found it helpful of me just covering these assets showcasing them and reminding you that you have them to claim for free as well for you to be able to keep forever if you did enjoy it please do make sure to like and subscribe down below as it really does help me and the channel out a lot so thanks so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one